right, here she is. Boom, boom. Here we go. Hi. Hi, Kelly. Happy Mother's Day to Happy you. Happy Mother's Day. <laughs> <laughs> How's your day going so far? My day's really nice, actually. I get to check in with all my girls, who I, I and I haven't been able to do this in a while, you know? I know, so, no, for sure. Well, you're doing a beautiful job hosting so far. Mommy, can you go? Thank you so much. Yes, baby, I'll be right there. Daddy's inside. Oh, I'm so sorry. Okay, baby, I'll be right there. I do have a comment for you. Thank you, <laughs> Thank you Stella. Oh my goodness. Well, you know, never stops. Mommy duty never stops. Um, I mean, I'm always moved by your singing voice, but the way you just spoke to your children was filled <laughs> with pure love and it sounded like it sounded like a romance novel mixed with a little velvet. Like it was just <laughs> it was just really special. It was very nice. You know what? If there's one thing I've learned about the approach, I can't see you anymore. I see Oh, you can't? No, it's turned around. Oh, no. Can you see me? Wait, I can see you. Shout out to all the mothers out there. Happy Mother's Day. Yes. I loved your interview with Sierra. It was so perfect. I, she always has such beautiful words of wisdom. She's she really such a does. wise, virtuous I mean, woman. Yes. And she yes. just loves to just give it out. She just oozes She's it all day long. like an owl, like with a wind machine. Wind. And just like... <laughs> And just like literally, like changed my entire changed my entire spirit and energy yeah, for the yeah, day. Like she just like yeah. gave it to me, and yeah. then had a and then had the wind and then signed off. So, <laughs> I mean, wow, she's really she's really worked it out. Oh, for sure, for sure. Um, so, so what? Do, what is, are you? Oh, go ahead. No, tell me. No, I was like, what are your plans? What are you going to do this Mother's Day? What is everyone doing out there for this Mother's Day? I mean, besides being home and quarantined and, and everything. Yeah. But I mean, I'm very fortunate and lucky that I live in California. Um, and it's nice and sunny here. So, you know, I told my kids that I want to I wanna go swimming with them. That's my oh, that's one nice. request. Um, that's nice. Yeah. What are you going to do? I'm honestly going to do the to same thing. I speak to them in that beautiful, perfect voice. We are going to, <laughs> thank you, very sweet. But we're going to go swimming. Um, we're in Cali, too, so we're just going to chill. It's really beautiful weather. And um, eat. I love to eat. Yes, yes, <laughs> yes. Okay, are you going to cook? Are you going to pick up? I'm going to cook. I'm going to attempt to cook. I'm not very good at cooking, so you can mm -hmm. imagine this quarantine has been like a lot of grilled cheese, yep. uh, some vegetables. Yes. I'm learning. I'm yeah. learning, Nicole. I'm learning. Can I tell you um, a few things that I like to just keep in my refrigerator that's like Please. great for it, simple stuff? I'm just saying yes. like guacamole goes a long way. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. Very yes, long way. Avocados. Uh -huh. You know? Yeah, if you have and if you have a bunch of avocados, like then the kids can just go in chips and chips and guacamole. That's good. Okay. Um, I like to do a little bruschetta, which is like like some cherry tomatoes, basically basil. Got fancy on me. No, it's not. No, no, no. That's it. tomatoes, basil, okay. garlic, olive oil, and balsamic. Is that it? That's it. Just I can a little that. toast if I you need that. to. That's okay. good for the kids. Um, and then. I do, this is not fancy. Do you have a slow cooker? Yes. Throw a bunch of chicken in there and do a, and do a slow cooker chicken sh that shred it up, whatever, mm -hmm. marinate it with whatever you want. And then okay. you can put that in tacos all week, quesadillas, in salads. It goes so a long smart. way. Okay. Yeah. I will do so those that. Are my three I will do that. But I'll say. Okay. Have you played any games since you've been in quarantine? Um, with your kids? Have I played any games? No, they're like, they're like try, trying to be too cool for games. Tell me what I know. How old? They're 10 and 12, 12 and a half. You have a 10 and a 12 year old? Yeah. Grown yeah. child? Yes. And, and they've got see? social calendars and attitudes. <laughs> I just take what I can get. But I mean, do you play games? I would love to. Maybe I'll, maybe you tell me a game and then I will try and play it with them. 
I mean, me and Titan just bust, uh, we just bust out Twister for the first time, which was, okay, you know okay. what I mean? So he's having a yes. really good time with that. I can get down with Twister because I'm yeah. very flexible. Yeah, okay. I, I, that's been fun. Um, he loves Candyland. Like, we've been playing a lot of games. Ooh, a Candyland throwing it back. Right? He loves yes, Candyland, Candyland and it's like a game. serious throwback. Aww. Okay, yeah. No, that's, a, that's I, I play Candyland. Yeah, <laughs> I know. I love it. <laughs> I really do. Um, and then what What else? What other games? Twister, Candyland. What other games? Let's see. Twister, Candyland. Oh, the one with the thing on the the cards. What do you call those? The oh, cards? Um, you guess? Yes. I do like that one. He and then like, guess? Well, headbands. I think they call it. Yeah, headbands. Headbands. So he headbands, loves okay. that. Yes, it's a, yes, the yes. version for I kids. Like he that. loves it. Yeah. Okay. For sure. And is, are your kids musical? Like, do you play any, like, musical games? Well, I just have one. I would love another one whenever God decides to bless me with another one. Uh, we don't play a lot of musical games. He just likes to sing. Like, right now he's um, into Finding Nemo and Finding Dory. Yep. And he knows all the theme songs. Like, yep. da -da -da -da. like, he knows all the moods of the songs in the movie. It's the weirdest, most strange thing. But he loves it. And so yeah. that's his thing. He memorizes that from Jurassic World, Finding Nemo, any movie he's drawn to. He remembers all the music. It's very weird. That's that's very cool. That's <laughs> very cool. Yeah. That's very sweet. Um, well, I feel like, when's the last time I, I saw you um, at the Baby to Baby event, I remember? Yes. And that was so much fun. Um, Absolutely. I didn't want the night to stop. We had so much fun dancing and we raised oh. so much money to yeah. help so many families. It was so beautiful. Yeah. I, I yeah, always look forward to seeing what that number is. And you do such a beautiful job in driving the energy of the room. Oh my and God. And you and Ali Wong, y'all killed it this like last year. Last year. Thank you. But y'all killed it. It was so much fun. It was. It was a lot of fun. Yeah. Well, Kelly, I hope to see you soon when we are out in the world again. When, Absolutely. When the world is different. I, I wish you the best Mother's Day. Um, Thank you. Lucky your son that he gets to. Do you scold your kids in that uh, vocal tone as well? Is that, Do I you, was that, was that your mad voice? Because Oh, like, no, no, oh. no. The mad voice has much more bass to it's it. It's got like, a little bass. Okay. Hey, okay. Man, just wanted I, to make you know, sure. Yeah. I, was like, I have oh. to bring a little bit more, you know. Yeah, yeah, voice. yeah. For sure. Because I feel like they would just go into a dream state. I don't know if they would, like, really <laughs> learn their lesson, you know? No. Okay. No, you got to change that tone up, for sure. They yeah. know you're serious. Yeah. All right. All right. Well, happy Mother's Day, and happy Mother's Day to all the incredible mothers out there. And I'll see you soon. All right. See you soon. All right. Bye. All right, guys. Well, this has been exciting. It's been challenging. It's been happy, sad, stressful. There's been songs. It's really been quite an event. I mean, I feel like more things have happened to me in this live than when I'm at the actual baby to baby gala. So who knew? Get so much done at home. Um, I really want to thank Nordstrom's. I want to thank Nordstrom's once again um, for helping us out with, with today's event, for being our sponsor. Um, I am going to connect our next guest. Guys, I don't want to speak too soon, but it looks like it's happening. Hey, girl. Hey. Yes. Queen. I mean, oh, so I joined the live stories when Jennifer Gardner was on, and I was like, this bitch looks beautiful. Nicole oh, she looks gorgeous. I put on yeah. one eyebrow, and then I went away, and then I came back, Ciara was on, and then I put another eyebrow on. And then Did I you see the wind machine? Would you know. say? So Sierra has her, she had a she had a meeting with Mother Nature and like just had like a natural wind machine happening. You did too. All of you look so dewy. Look oh like God. a little little. <laughs> I don't know, Mary. Too. Okay, I'll, I'll take in the morning. I'll take that. Yeah. <laughs> you look like a little little. Ooh, got a tail. You got like... <laughs> I have a tail. Okay, you look That's like a little animal. Not what I, I imagine. got a tail. I got dew on it. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, you but, look like a gorge queen. You look colorful and cool and like, you. you know. 
I always no, like, I, you know, you I, I have fun with you. In 10 days. What? I haven't washed my hair in 10 days. But what's, you do your pigtail, um, do you have uh, two ponytails in? Yeah, this is how you know. Or are they braids? My hair. Mm -hmm. And then when I take I it. I like that hairstyle. It's a good one. It's a good one to hide the grease. When I took it yeah. out last night, a mop. Braids are always out. best. If you're going to have dirty hair, then you just do, I would say just do a braid. Yeah, because then it works like, um, like balm for your hair. It's not grease. Yeah, it's like a nice leave-in conditioner and you don't get frizzy hair. Right. But but last night a moth flew out when I took them out. And so it flew might be- Flew out of um, your hair? My hair. Oh, cool. Yeah, so- Did it I go did. into your closet? <laughs> it went into my closet and ate all of the dresses that I'll never wear huh. again. That moth has, I think that moth has it out for you. <sighs> We'll How see what doing? lies. You know what? It's been a few days. I'm realizing just as you said that, that I've been swimming a lot and I don't know. I, this is the first time I'm thinking about this. Have I washed my hair all week or have I thought that I did because I went swimming? I don't know. It looks amazing. So we'll see. We'll see if anything flies out. Yeah. You'd be like, I'll a, look. I feel like, I felt like a, a Disney princess of the wild. These animals. Yeah, right yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, no? yeah, it's like, your, ah! it's like your superpower. Yeah. yeah, you know, I think it's important, especially if bugs are going to fly out of your hair to like create a soundtrack behind it. Mm. So that it feels powerful. Yes. How are you? I'm good. I'm happy to be here and chat with my friends. And I'm happy to be here on behalf of baby to baby because I love what they're doing. And you know, they've I love what they're doing. I'm so sad million that the event is, you know, that a lot of their events got canceled for yep. the year. So I'm so happy to be there here today to try to help. Um, yeah, I, you know, I yeah. yeah, exactly. And I feel like, you know, um, we did the live auction last year. We did. It was scary, but it was really fun. I was scared. I, I mean, I do it. This is, I've been doing it for a few years now and I'm, I'm always scared. Um, but yes. I had fun doing it with you because I think besides moths flying out of your hair, I think your <laughs> second superpower is, um, that you're just a down, you know, cool, very smart woman, you know, who just, I think like you make me feel comfortable and make people around you feel comfortable. And, um, it's a very intimidating stage to be on. And it was nice to go out there and be with you. Like I had the best time. I had the best time too. I, I remember too, I think we raised $4.6 million, but that number was so big on the screen behind us that I was like, yes. I couldn't even read the number yes. because it was so long. And it happened it was, fast. It happened fast. And then yeah. the confetti came. And Paul, and then Paula Abdul whisked us all away. I mean, it only happens once a year, once really in a lifetime, where like all of a sudden, like I'm on stage with Ali Wong, and then the next, <laughs> there's confetti dropping down on me, and then the ne and then I turn to the left, and Paula Abdul <laughs> is like doing Cold Hearted Snake, like which I've been <laughs> dreaming about seeing in person since 1991. <laughs> like, like what? I was like, this isn't real. This isn't this real. This was a crazy. forever your forever your girl on forever your girl yes 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 Ooh. yes forever your girl well this is what i've been up to tell me this is jennifer garner trying to flex with her crafts you know i know I okay oh yeah is that hair on top what is that yeah that's hair okay hair and the okay you you're coming it. in strong with the crafts too come in strong don't fuck with my pipe cleaner claw Whoa, okay. Mm -hmm. You know what? And I'm into your color palette. Like you're going like bright and sparkly. I, okay, I see you, I see you. Wow. Whoa. Yeah. What's up, Jennifer this Gardner? Is, this is, okay. <laughs> wow, you know what? I just learned a lot about you. Yeah, these. This is our yeah. life now. You yeah. Know? Okay. Yeah. Well, crafting. I we went from yeah, crafting. Cold-hearted snake to this. 
Forever Your Girl to Forever Crafting. Forever Crafting. But uh, yeah, I mean, I feel for, I just think about, you know, in, how hard it, it's, it's been challenging for me, for a lot of us, you know, for a lot of us moms to not have our kids in school. But I mean, I can't even think about what it's like to not have diapers. Diapers you know, at home, yep. Time. I think about that all the time with baby to baby, how it's just like a simple thing that they provide that's so meaningful, you know? Yes. Yep. Um, a absolutely. And um, to everybody out there, if you want to learn more about what we are doing, go to baby to baby, mothersday.org. Um, baby to baby does incredible work and um, Ali and I both work with them. And, um, you know, it, I think it's very important in this moment to uh, focus on, on your entire community. We all need to come together right now um, and give back where we can. So thank you so much for joining us, Allie. Of course. Good to see you, Nicole. Good to see you. See all you right. soon. See you soon. Happy Mother's Day. Bye. Happy Mother's Day. Bye. All right, guys. Well, I don't want to get um, cocky, but that worked out really well and smooth. So um, hopefully that will continue as I add my next guest, who I am very excited about, Kate Hudson, joining us in the his. Is it Kate next? Yes. Kate. Just waiting for Kate to sign on. Um, and you guys, if you want to learn more about what baby to baby is doing, make sure to go to baby to baby mothersday.org. Um, I'm going to try and pin it, but right now I'm just trying to add Kate. Here. 